Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I'm gonna show you how to get the perfect wavy blowout at home. If you want to learn how I get this look done, keep on watching. You'll need a hair dryer of course, a round brush and I'm using the nanotechnology from Bibtim. It's super lightweight, it distributes the heat evenly because it's vented and it has two types of bristles which makes it firm enough to hold the hair. You'll need some clips and bobby pins. So the first thing I do, I add a leave-in conditioner to my damp hair. You can skip this step if you have straight hair because it will weigh it down. And make sure to towel dry or air dry your hair for at least 30 minutes, otherwise you'll expose your hair to excessive heat which will eventually damage the hair. And by the way, I've used the Don't Despair Repair from Briogeo. And then I seal it with a drop of the Oleo Relax Kerastase Oil and I love, love this oil because it adds shine, great for detangling and my hair does not feel greasy or oily afterwards. And I focus the products on my ends. Then I disperse whatever I have left in my hands all over. Then I comb my hair to detangle it and get rid of any knots with a wet brush. And by the way, I'll leave all the details of the products in the description down below. Then I section my hair to two parts, I clip the top parts away from my face, I leave the bottom part loose and I take half of a section. And I'm gonna blow dry it from roots to ends, focusing on the roots and the strands. I do both sides, the top and under, until my hair is nice and smooth and I'm satisfied with the way it looks. Then I start curling the ends and the smaller the brush, the tinier the curls are going to be. And the key here is to keep twisting and turning the brush while drying the hair and this motion will smooth out those tiny frizzy little hairs. Then I'm gonna roll the hair with my fingers and clip it away with a bobby pin while it's still warm. And you can adjust the size of the roll to your liking and where do you want the curl to start from. Then I remove little sections as I'm going along, starting with the right side. And I take a smaller brush and I focus on my baby hairs because the big brush won't do them. Then I blow dry the remaining section with the big brush just like I did. Then I repeat the same for the rest of my hair and I'm gonna fast forward the blow dry session because I didn't want to cut anything out and so you can see the blow drying process. I focus on the roots and strands first, both sides, then I curl the ends and roll them up and clip in them with a bobby pin and the more you do this the easier it gets. And then once I get to the top section of my hair, I like to blow dry pulling up to get that extra volume. Because why not? You can also use duck bill clips if you have. I don't. Plus my bobby pins work just fine. Because today I wanted my curls to be opened up, that's why I'm twisting outwards. You can also twist inwards or both, depending on the style you're going for. And I wait for about 15 minutes for the hair to cool down, then I remove all the pins and I open the rolls with my fingers and my brush and voila! And by the way, I have another giveaway for you guys today. And all you need to do is to subscribe, share any video of mine on Instagram and leave a comment down below with your foundation shape. And the winner will be announced in the next video. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching. See you soon. Bye.